Hey everyone, it's Shiny Sparky, and welcome to Harvest Moon Magical Melody. So, I should make a note of something right now. This is actually a post commentary. Do you know why? Because in this video, I basically recorded about 42 minutes of footage. I'm not kidding when I say that. 42 minutes. And, um, to be honest, that was a lot. Like, I mean, seriously, that, that's a ton. So, the reason why I did that much is because in this video, I did a lot of fishing. And it eventually got to the point where I was fishing for a certain fish for so damn long that I just decided to cut to the good parts of when I got the things that I needed, you know, the certain fish or the garbage or whatever. So I cut out a total of like, what, over 20 minutes of footage of fishing? Which is pretty crazy to be honest. But yeah, I also did other things like for example right now I went to Maria and you know I gave her this stuff. And it's all good, you know, yeah. But... Like I said, it's post-commentary, so I know what's going to happen in this video. Usually, I don't like doing post-commentaries, but if it's a video this long with this many cuts, it's usually a better idea to do it, just because I can, I, like, I could have actually played the game a bit, bit more relaxed, because if I was doing it live, I would have gotten so pissed off, like, my commentary would have given off, like, a pissed off tone, you know, and I didn't really want that. I didn't. So I figured it was much better to just, um, do a post-commentary. So here I am heading to the, uh, you know, the island, whatever. Because we all know that the island is probably one of the best places to fish, definitely. Okay, sorry about all that background noise, I was taking care of something. So, in this video, well, I mean, I showed off a little bit about just me fishing for whatever. I mean, I failed fishing right there, look at that. I, uh, released it a bit too early, I must say. But, now, there are how many more fish? There is the Schnapper, there is the um, Yellowtail, and then there's the, the Left Boot and the Right Boot, which, yes, the Left Boot and Right Boot are actually necessary in order to obtain the Expert Angler Note, which means catching one of every fish. Even though the Left Boot and the Right Boot are not technically fish, they do still count for the nose. So here's my first cut, because, you know, I feel like I about five minutes worth of stuff there. And I got a can. I decided to show this off because I am still looking for the rubber boots note, you know, so you have to catch 10 trash. Now after about 10 minutes or so of fishing, actually a little bit less than that, I finally got the Schnapper, the rather rare fish I must say, but he only appears in the northern island during winter. That is the only time you can get the Schnapper, so pretty damn hard I must say. But for this day I am finished, I mean look at that. And after a good hard day's work of getting, what was it, um, the can and the schnapper, I decided to go back and sleep, of course. I mean, yeah, this video for the most part is just fishing, but don't worry, because after this video, I never have to fish ever again. I don't, because I'm going to be getting all the fishing stuff, like expert angler and the rubber boots and whatever, you know. So it's all good. It definitely is. And here I ship the stuff, which are not worth too much, but it's some money, you know. And then there's a schnapper, which is not worth a lot. I thought it would, actually 200, I mean, it's pretty good for fish. But like, I thought it would be worth like almost 500, because it seemed really where It took me forever to try and catch the schnapper. It really did. Now in here I went back in the barn, but I think I had already attended my animals for that day. Because I had actually done that at the end of part 63, because it was still the same day. But yeah, it's that. So, of course, by this point, you know, I decide to go to bed. You know, with my large bed. Because I have a big house now, finally. It took a long time, but I finally did it. The whole big house upgrade, you know. And today is a snowy day. I believe the winter, yeah, winter night was the first snowy day in the game. In winter. Now, there is actually a snow note. And you get it by just staying outside for, like, what, 12 hours? Actually, a little bit less than that. I think, like, I want to say 10 hours? I think it's 10 hours. But anyways, Ray does move back in. The reason for that is because I ship fish. If you want Ray to stay in town, keep shipping fish. That's all I can say. Because, I mean, I ship how many, like, freaking 10 total in all these last two days? And I've, like, it's crazy. It really is. Who the hell is 
Oh, sorry, I looked at my phone for a second there. I mean, the thing is, I really need to start adjusting my Gmail stuff, because, like... Oh, God. Okay, <laughs> sorry about that. I mean, like, I'm reading my messages here, and, like, I'm getting all the Gmail stuff, and it's kind of crazy as to how many messages I get, just because, like, first of all, every single time I upload a video, I get a message, like, congrats, your video has been uploaded. Or anytime somebody, um, like, anytime somebody subscribes, or anytime somebody, uh, comments in a video, I, of course, get a G, uh, like, an email, but it's whatever. So, anyways, um, for, oh, yeah, yeah, but in terms of emails, like, I was saying that you just, like, delete, or, like, um, how should I say it, um, not get email notifications, just because, I mean, I already get all that stuff in, of course, YouTube, I just go on there and comment to all the comments, you know, so, like, sometimes, like, what's the point of getting the email, too, because I'm gonna go on YouTube, too, and, you know, reply to everything, so, whatever. Yeah, and also, like, I recently started catching up in Twitter. Like, I'm actually active on that, finally, after not being active for so freaking long, but I'm active now. And I am getting, like, emails about that, too. Like, oh, this person retweeted you. Oh, this person favorited you. Like, favorited one of your comments or whatever. One of your tweets, sorry. I keep saying, God, I need a... I mean, it just shows you. I'm not that active on Twitter still. Or, like, I haven't been, because I still call them comments. Like, who calls Twitter comments? You call tweets, man. You call tweets. I guess you can call them posts, too, but, like, they're tweets. Okay, now somebody just freaking texted me, and, like, what the hell? No, 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 don't, you freaking... What the hell's... Oh. Never mind. I... Okay, sorry. Okay, what am I doing reading messages, like, in a video? I'm doing a... I guess the reason is because I'm doing a post commentary, and I get more distracted, like, more bored, because I'm not actually playing the damn game, you know? So yeah. <laughs> but anyways, as far as like the horse goes, I do need to start riding it very soon. Simply because, I mean, the spring horse race is in what, spring, I want to say 18? I have it right here, let me see. 17, spring 17. So, because of that, it is very important to start riding the horse so, yeah, so I can actually win a freaking race, seriously. Also, if you sell a horse that won, a horse race, you get 50,000 G for the horse, which is honestly freaking ridiculous. It really is. And then, like, I mean, there are so many that are just very, like, they, they take so much work. First of all, there's a the very rich note, which costs 100,000 G. Kind of crazy. I mean, I mean, I mean, cost as in, like, like, you need 100,000 G to unlock the note, so technically it does cost 100,000 G. Although you don't actually spend 100,000 G. But... Yeah, there's that, and then there's of course, like, Animal Kingdom, which means you have to fill up all your, like, your chicken coop of five chickens, and, get, and then get eight animals in the barn, which is so much. Oh my god, it's a lot. Like, there are some notes that piss me off so much in this game, but... You gotta do them. Also, the horse race, like... Winning the horse race, I just do, like, I hate it because I have to ride my horse around so much, and I hate get, getting my horse out, riding her, going, putting her back in at the end of the day, like, it's so damn, it takes so much time, it really does, and it's just annoying. But then, like, there are other ones that just take time, like, let's say the Wild Note, befriending an animal to, like, what, five hearts, I think, or is it four? I think it's four or five. And then there's the mole whacking though, whacking 10 moles, which takes time to... And like, it's just... It's a lot. But anyways, for now, I decided to of course come back in here and fish some more. Just because, you know, fishing is good. It's definitely a good thing. Now the funny thing is that in here, on the first try, I got the fish that I wanted. This one. This is known as a yellowtail. Uh, the last remaining fish in the game, which only appears during winter and spring in the southern part of the island, which is right here. So, the yellowtail, I believe, is kind of an uncommon, like, uh, fish, but I got it on the first try. Now, I'm gonna go back here, like, the past me goes back in here to actually see what the hell I'm missing, because 
By this point, I'm like, hmm, let's see if I miss any normal fish. But no, I got every fish in the game. The only thing I'm missing now is the left boot and the right boot. Now, the right boot is kind of a pain to get simply because it's considered a king fish because it's rare and it takes a long time. Like, it takes hard work to catch it too. You gotta press it repeatedly like crazy. The left boot is not so hard. It's, a, it's just, it's uncommon, but the right boot is the rare one. That one's rare. Now, the best place to get the, uh, the boots are actually in the Delta. The Delta is directly below the river, and it's on the part in which the river almost splits into the ocean. Like, it almost goes out into the ocean. It's, it's right in between the ocean and the final bridge. And I will be going there in this video. Like, you will see. But now, the other thing that I do is actually... Wait, do I do that right now? Because I also go for the snow note in this video. Yeah, basically right here. After I ship these things, the mushroom and the yellowtail, I leave my character there for like eight hours or something, and I eventually get it right here. Right here I just stop, and there's a cut. Basically, I got the snow note right here. So again, the snow note is a rather easy one. Simply stay outside in the snow for like, what, eight to ten hours? I think it's ten hours. So don't like, don't go inside buildings, don't go to the caves. Don't even go to Sunny Lake, because if you go to Sunny Lake, it cancels out. It does not work. And now, another cut. This time, I show myself getting something good. The left boot. The left boot is the one that is less rare. So, it is overall easier to obtain. Okay, another cut here. And this time, I basically just... What the hell do I do? Oh yeah, I just warp. I go to bed because I got this. I got the left boot, and then it was too late to keep fishing on that day, because you know I got the snow note. I stayed out for too long, and I think like if you fish, you also will not be getting the snow note, and the sun note, and the cloud note, and the rain note, like so freaking many. So yeah, just a heads up about that. Now the next thing is um. Oh, what did I do? Oh, here's a ladder by Bob. You can't grow crops once- yeah, whatever. Oh yeah, so I have the boot- the boot left. Boot parentheses left, yeah, so... With the boot, make sure to throw it in the trash because it's, well... Trash. Don't litter. People will hate you if you do that. Do not do that. It always must go into the trash. The trash can. So now, for this day, I do return once again to the um, fishing spot right here in the Delta. Because in the Delta, there is, well, a lot of trash. Now, there is a high chance to be getting trash. And yes, you can get multiple left boots like what I, what I did right now. That's another left boot. And you can also get a lot of cans. So overall, it's really nice for getting, like, the uh, rubber boots note. For getting 10 pieces of garbage. The boots do count for the rubber boots note. Basically, all cans, left boots, and right boots count for that note. But, for the expert angler, you want to be getting the left boot and right boot in addition to all fish in the game. And I think a can counts too. And here, I finally obtain what is the very rare... It's considered a, quote, kingfish. I mean, why? I have no freaking idea, but it is. The kingfish. And it is, in fact, a... Boot. Very strange. This one. Boot. Right. Now in here I actually got uh, what appears to be a glitch. Watch this. Because I got my 10th trash at the same time I got the final one. It gave me the rubber boots note which means that I got 10 trash. But the other note didn't activate. So I was like, oh my god. What the hell. What the hell game. But eventually I figured that... You should just fish, get one more fish, and then what happens is that you get this. No, wait, one sec. Catch any other fish, and then you obtain the next note. So I guess it's kind of a glitch, I must say. It's rather strange, but there we go. It's like the game's way of saying, no, you can't get two notes at the same time, so you have to fish again. So if that happens to you, if you somehow get the rubber, the rubber boots note with the expert angler at the same time, I mean, it just happened for me, then... Just fish one more time and you will get the second note. 
it's rather simple. So, in this video I got the Expert Angler, the um, what the hell is it? Oh, the Snow Note, that's right, the Snow Note, and the Rubber Boots Note. So three notes in one video, not bad. Not bad at all. But, with that being said, now that I have the, all the boots, and of course the Expert Angler, I already had the Master Angler, and now that I got the uh, Rubber Boots, this means that I do not have to fish anymore for the rest of the game. I can put my fishing rod away and never fish again. Of course, that'll mean Ray moves out again, but I mean, I don't need Ray anymore in this village at this point. You know, it's as evil as that sounds. I mean, it is true. It, it is. And like, I don't know. So for the final event of this video, not event, what am I saying? I'm saying event. The final thing in this video, I decide to go back and feed my animals and attend them. But of course, I have to, um, like the the wool grew on my sheep. So it was a nice addition, I must say. Very nice. And there we go. I go brushing. And yeah, it was... It was fun, to say the least. It really was. But I mean, I am really happy that now there's one more thing that I never have to do ever again, and that's fishing. Because, like, the more notes you get, eventually you realize that now that's just one more thing that you don't have to do anymore. So it's nice. It's really fun to see that, you know? But, like, there are other things that are still on my mind. Because, man, even though I have, like, what, 70 notes I want to say or something? Almost that much, maybe? Like, there are still a lot of things to do, a lot of things on my mind. Because this game, it is, like, complete opposite of, of uh, A Wonderful Life. Because A Wonderful Life... It's very slow and casual, you know? Like, it doesn't take a lot to get everything in the game, but in this game, you need to be quick about everything. I mean, it's not as fast as Harvest Moon 64, because in Harvest Moon 64, you do have a real, like, time. Like, if you miss out on something for a certain day of the year one, you can never get it again, and you can not get the 100% ending, like the final perfect ending. So, it's very annoying in that matter. Wool worth 900G, very nice. So that was an easy 1100G for that day. But basically by this point I am done with the video, so... Oh yeah, there we go, putting my stuff away. It's like, yes, no more fishing rod, thank god. And I'm just organizing stuff, you know. So I have a moonstone there and very soon I will be having Maria at 2.5 hearts. It's only a matter of time before that happens. And then once I get that, I believe it is time to propose. Time to get married. Time to make more progress, you know? But yeah, we'll see. We will definitely see. So, with that being said, I'm done here. Thank you for watching, goodbye everybody, and until next time.